And I always tell the patients when we talk about the robot, we, you know, we do your surgery or I do your surgery, the robot is a tool that helps us. I wouldn't say they're brand new at this point. They're, they're pretty well developed, but the future, in the future, I think they're going to be even more developed and do even more parts or assist in more parts of your surgery. I always say they'll never completely replace a surgeon because you really, the, the robot is doing sort of what you program it to do. And, and for spine surgery, it's helping us put the hardware in accurately. So we're able to design where our screws go and where our rods are going to be, you know, ahead of time so that when we get in there, you know, we, we really aren't running into issues that we might have without the robot where, you know, things look a little different or we, uh, you know, the screws don't line up quite as well. So I find it a very, very helpful tool. But again, it's really helping us put the hardware in. It's not at the point where it's helping us, you know, decompress the nerves or do some of the other things. But it is progressing even in the three years that I've used it. They've sort of refined the software to make it more accurate and, and really a better tool, helping us a little more each, each, with each iteration.